In this lesson, we will see together the construction of a verbal periphrase. So, of course, the question is, what is une periphrase? So, a periphrase is a figure of speech. It consists of replacing a word by its definition or by a longer but equivalent expression. So, in other words, it consists of saying with several words what could be expressed by a single word or by several other words. So, this is une Periphrase. And definitely the concept here is a figure of speech. So expressing one concept in a different way. So this lesson is about the construction of a verbal periphrase. In a verbal periphrase, the infinitive retains its full meaning while the auxiliary verb loses its strong meaning. So let's have a look at the first one, for instance. Je peux le dire. And it means, je suis capable de le dire. Je peux le dire. The second one. Je peux t'aider. Si tu veux. Meaning by that, il est possible que je t'aide. Je peux t'aider si tu veux. And the last one. Il peut être l'heure de manger. And it means, il est possible qu'il soit l'heure de manger. Il peut être l'heure de de manger. So, as you can see, in these cases, the verb pouvoir loses its main, main meaning. Je peux le dire will mean je suis capable de le dire. Then you use je peux t'aider si tu veux. Same thing here, this Pouvoir, the auxiliary verb, will lose its first meaning because it means il est possible que je t'aide. Same goes for the third one. Il peut être l'heure de manger. Same thing goes for pouvoir here. It loses its first meaning because it is now il est possible qu'il soit l'heure de manger. So remember that this is quite classic. Huh? So the auxiliary verb, and the one that you use in the first place here, hein? je peux, je peux, il peut, it will lose its strong first meaning.